What's up, everybody? We're live on YouTube. How's everybody doing? What's up, Jay? What's up, Sh What's up, Shedrick? How you doing, man? We got the AFC Championship between the Browns and the Ravens tonight. Some good stuff. Let's see what my man RC is rolling with here. What's up, Connor Morris? What's up, Jay? I appreciate you liking the video, man. If you guys haven't liked the video yet, go ahead and hit the like button. I'd really appreciate it. All right, we got my man RC Ravens, and we got Talented as the Browns. What's up, Keenan Nichols? How you doing, man? What's up? What's up, Jay? How's it going, man? Can you guys hear me alright? Is my music, is my uh, sound alright? Let's do a little mic check here. I'm trying a different arrangement tonight with the microphone. I actually really like this arrangement, so I really hope it works out for me. I'm going to move some stuff around. question for you guys in the chat if I did a video on how to pick up the user rush in Madden 21 the user rush that everybody rolls with would you guys like to see a video like that from under center because I've been running a little bit of under center and I've been getting user rushed like crazy all right here we go NFL playoffs 2020 we've got Rams and Browns Yashi tough loss to to um, Tough loss to Mason last night You want to see how to pick up the user rush? I'll show you real quick. Let me jump back over here. Let me see. Where's my mouse at? Let me jump over here to game here. All right, check this out. While they're loading up, I'll teach you guys how to stop the user rush. I might do a video on it tomorrow. So basically what you do... Oh, of course, I have the wrong... Uh, let me, gra let me grab... Uh, let me grab the right playbook. I was testing out a little rollout play with Lamar. So here's how to pick up the user rush. Let me get the playbooks and, and then we'll uh, jump in. I've been getting blitzed like crazy under center, so I had to figure out my pass protection. Once you actually practice it a little bit, under center is not that hard to pass protect from. It actually might be a little bit better than... Uh... What? What's up, Corbin? Somebody just... Ask me a question. Blew my mind. Why did I put what? All right, I'll show you guys the user rush here. So let's see. Let's grab the let's grab the Giants book, and we'll walk through this real quick. All right, Keenan, no problem. I'll get you that video. A lot of people are interested in the West Coast. A lot of people. Also, if you haven't followed me on TikTok yet, exclamation point TikTok in the chat. All right, these competitors are almost ready to go. What's up, Yashi? All right, check this out. Yashi, let me know if you've done this on your uh, on your West Coast. This is how to stop. 
This is how to stop the user rush from far tight. I played a guy last night, literally user rush me every play. So they're going to come out in Mike Blitz 3. Now to set up the user rush properly, they have to shift their D-line to the left. And then they have to take their user and put him right here. And you're probably used to this right here. Uh, basically, if you send five out, what they're going to do is they're going to use a rush right through the a gap and not make it's not going to be fun as you can see right there it's going to be some type of a gap a gap pressure right let me show you one more time whoa and we'll cover this after the game we'll cover this after the game all right here we go we got baltimore ravens What's up, everybody? We got Baltimore Ravens and Cleveland Browns AFC Championship. Excited to bring this to you. Live commentary. We got Unrated as the Cleveland Browns and RC as the Baltimore Ravens. It's going to be a great matchup. And uh, we're going to be recording this live tonight. We're going to share it on our YouTube channel tomorrow. So if you hear me interacting with the live chat, that's kind of what I'm doing. If you guys have any questions about what you see in the gameplay, you can always text me. My number is 812 216 3644 it's in the description as well but right off the rip here got two competitors to be honest with you i know what rc is going to do i'm not quite sure what unrated is going to do so looks like rc is going to do some different adjustments here he's going ball in air defense to play ball he's going to put his quarterback matchups to speed it's interesting to me that he's setting his defensive adjustments up while he's on the offensive side of the ball i actually think that's genius jay is pretty pumped up let's go all right, so uh, RC is going to be running the New England Patriots on offense. Now, if you haven't picked up the New England Patriots offensive ebook that I wrote, it's over 300 pages long with over 36 formations, exclamation point, in E in the chat. If you're watching on YouTube later, this is available via the description. You can get that link right there. He's going to come out, start out with a little ISO run on Ezekiel Elliott. Letting Zeke do what Zeke is going to do. Now you're going to see him go to the trips tight end. Now the trips tight end is the bread and butter of this scheme. He's also got the U-trips and the gun bunch in his arsenal. So it's going to be interesting to see kind of what he does. He's got a really good spread as well. One of the things that I like about New England is obviously the best offense in the game, in my opinion, because it has the most options. You can do so many things from the New England Patriots playbook. Uh, in this game. So uh, be interested to see how RC runs this. Honestly, haven't seen a whole lot of people. I've seen a lot of people running New England, but RC I know has the ebook. So it'll be interesting to see kind of how he uses it and interesting to see kind of what he does here. So he's going to go out with a little doubles in sale. Zeke Elliott to the sideline. A quick read there for a nice, easy seven yards. Good read by my man RC. All right. Looks like he's going to go to the RPO alert bubble. And I'm going to take his little dive there. Good defense by Talented. Now, uh, Talented is running, I believe he's running Dime 146. Is that what I see? He might. I'm pretty sure he might be in Dime 236, but he's in some kind of Dime set. Um, got the drag there right off the rip. Godwin, or Marquise Goodwin to the sideline. Great read from my man RC. Getting going here. Jay, Jay, you picked up the ebook as well. I appreciate you guys picking up the ebook. If you haven't picked it up, exclamation point N E in the chat as well as in the description. But seriously, it's a beast of an ebook. Over 300 pages, man. It was a monster to put together. But it's it's a it's a wealth of Madden information. Looks like Dime 146 here for uh talented, which is interesting. I haven't seen a lot of people run Dime 146 against this defense. It's primarily probably because uh, RC is running with three wide receivers. So if RC was to put a running back in, um, he would be able to audible down to like I form, uh, I form or uh, I form wing, I believe, from the New England book. Not wing, I'm sorry, uh, whatever it's called with the 95 Willie. All right, so next play here looks like we're going double sale again. Ooh, that was a tight window throw, but RC is able to hit the in route. Baker Mayfield right now, 3 of 3, 24 yards, a great quarterback in the CFM mode because of the abilities that he has, um, his ability to make consistent throws for you in the pocket. Now, let's see here. Looks like he's going to go to gun A slot offset. This is one of my favorite formations in the game. This formation is so difficult to stop. It's probably one of the best red zone formations, in my opinion, just because of the 0-1 trap, the power O, the inside zone, all of the things that you can do from this. And if you use the live playbook version of the New England Patriots playbook, it'll give you a nice little read option that you can mix in as well. 
So it looks like he's going to come out and go to 01 Trap. This should torch this defense. 01 Trap should dominate this right here. Uh, let's see how this works out for him. A little motion over uh, to get a numbers advantage. And it gets about two yards. Now that's going to bring up a third and four. It's actually a big down in the game because if talent, if, if uh, unrated, if he could get a stop right here, what that's going to mean is he's going to be able to be up by one possession because he gets the ball at halftime. So be interesting to kind of see how this plays out here. Ball on the 33-yard line. Let's see what my man RC cooks up in a critical down and distance here from his 33-yard line. Third down and four. Going to RPO bubble. Looks like Unrated is going to dive 146. you got to believe this little bubble screen is going to be there for him. And it is not there. Great defense by my man unrated archie's going no huddle no huddle hurry up offense let's see if he tries to hit an inside zone let's see what he does he's gonna go to doubles and sail he's got the drag on the right side has the in route a quick route to zeke elliott zeke elliott gets to the sideline and he fumbles the football oh my goodness unrated with the ball up the field big time defensive stand for unrated you gotta feel unfortunate if you're rc you pick up the first down but man you gotta put your guys on conservative this year in my opinion huge mistake by rc early on in this game now, we're going to see Unrated. I've not honestly seen what he's doing on the offensive side of the football. So it'll be very interesting to see what he cooks up and what he brings to the dance. Now, it looks like uh, RC is going to run some nickel 335. Interesting. Unrated is going to come out and dice slot, single back dice slot. you got to be ready for the 01 trap. What's up, Bromwell? How you doing, man? Got to be ready for the 01 trap here. And it looks like we're going to go 3-4 odd. My man Yashi in the chat, probably a big fan of this defense. Going with a little cover four. I actually really like this defense right here. Look at this. little cover three invert out of the cover four drop. Uh, turn the cover four drop into a cover three invert. 0-1 trap. He's got run defense for it. Nice run right there. That fumble looks like Yashi's from yesterday. That's right, man. I'll tell you what. You've got to play on conservative in these big games, in my opinion. In my opinion is so critical to play on conservative in these big games. That's just my personal opinion. You can disagree. And there you see RC is going to switch it, go back to playing conservative football. Now, this will be interesting. Second and seven, what does Unrated do? Now, one of the things you'll notice, it doesn't seem like a big deal, but it's actually a huge deal. You notice that RC is waiting for Unrated to pick his play. And based off of Unrated's personnel, off of Unrated's plan, that's going to allow RC to then pick the right defense, whether it's going to be 3 4 odd, whether it's going to be nickel 55 odd, so, uh, or nickel 55. Now, interesting here, three wide receiver set, but he's still going to go 3 4 odd. Got a little mesh post there. Good read from Unrated. Hits the drag route right across the face and gets a big gain right on the bait here. Got Big Ben Roethlisberger. What's up, Bromwell? Got Big Ben Roethlisberger in the pocket. This will be interesting to see. Now, if you guys are watching this video and you have not already subscribed to the channel, research shows that only 40% of the people that watch my videos are actually subscribed to me. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button at the bottom right-hand corner of your screen. And if you're feeling extra generous, turn on no post, no post notifications so you can know whenever we upload a new video, which is every day at 2 o'clock, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. We also live stream just like tonight, every night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. So a lot of content. Hopefully you enjoy the videos we're able to produce for you. All right, so uh, picked up that first down on the counter. I actually like some of these runs I'm seeing. A little stretch right here. Uh, just kind of getting out there. Colonel Mustard, Raheem Mostert into the open field. And hit stick does not fumble the ball right there. So big play there by my man, unrated. All right, we've got first and 10. Ball on the 17-yard line, 3-4 odd in the red zone. Be an interesting type of deal here. Yeah, you notice RC runs a lot of 3-4 odd cover four drops. So, so be interesting. It'll be very interesting to see how this plays out. All right, we got 3-4 odd. And it looks like for unrated, I think this was like uh, shotgun wing, sl wing slot maybe. Wink stack. I don't know exactly what the terminology is called, but he's got two receivers to the right, two tight ends to the left side. Running a little jet touch pass is what it looks like. Jet touch pass. Andy Isabella to the left side, and he's going to pick up a grand total of zero yards. My man RC was ready for that right there. This will be very interesting to see what RC does on defense. I know his offense is going to be a lot of trips, a lot of New England. On defense, it's actually going to be very interesting to see what he does. So far, a lot of 3-4 odd. I'll be interested to see when he goes 
when he decides to go to nickel three through five or nickel three through five, um, or I'm sorry, dollar three through six. So it uh, looks like right here, single back dice slot. He's got a kind of a close offset formation here. You got to believe this is going to be a pass. I don't think this is going to be a run. Yep, 100% a pass right here. Runs a little HB slip screen to the left side, and he's going to scamper in for a touchdown. Colonel Mustard gets in unrated on the board early, and RC is now not really in a good position. Unrated gets ball half, and he's up by seven points. That's a big, 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 big deal. My man RC has got to answer back right here with a scoring drive. He needs to get seven points to keep himself moving forward in this matchup. Now, real quick, if you're watching this video and you haven't joined my text message membership, type exclamation point text in the chat. My number is 812-216-3644. We've got the far tight slot coming this week in the text message membership. Really excited to share that with you. Been labbing that for the last three or four days. Very, very excited to share you with some of the dots and some of the runs and some of the quick plays that um, that we've got cooked up for you. Yashi says, nice play call. Didn't expect that screen pass. Yeah, did not either. I thought I, I knew it was going to be a pass. I don't think it was going to run from that look. But now it looks like RC is going to go back to what got him here. PA counter go. You got to love this play call right here from RC. Working the drag. He's got the crossing route. But Maker Mayfield threw out a sack. Oh, my goodness. That's not good. Throw out a sack. Had the drag. That's a product of not taking what the defense gave you. Had the drag wide open instead. Tried to force the crossing route. And the crossing route was wide open. The only problem was the pressure got there. Throw out a sack. Pick six. Huge play of this game. Unrated is jumped out to a quick game. But here's the deal. There's a lot of football left to be played. A lot of football left to be played. I don't think Unrated's offense is that crazy good. So we'll be interesting to see what uh, what's going to happen here. This is a huge drive, though. If RC does not get points on this drive, I'm not saying it's GG's in the chat. But it's not good if he does not get points on this drive. Let's see if he fights here. Let's see what he brings to the dance. Let's see him run that PA counter go and hit the drag route this time. As that drag route was saying, please throw me the ball. I will get you 10 yards. Let's see what he cooks up right here on first and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. My man unrated. Stick with that dime 146. And let's see here. Oh, we had a little technical difficulty. Got the drag right here coming. Now we're going to go with the slant route, street combo, blocking, going man-to-man -man coverage. Everything is boxed. And let's throw that. Let's throw that away. Let's not force that. Let's throw that away, man. We cannot force that route. Come on. I want to see more motion slants. I want to see more motion slants. If he's going to run man coverage on you all game out of Diamond 146, I also want to see you audible down into eye formation, run the ball on him, get him out of that defense, force him to go to something else that would be my advice to a man rc in this scenario running the new england book 14 zip ball on the 25 second and 10 five minutes and 36 seconds left to go here in the second quarter split close path for my man rc and gonna go with a little quick route there to the back latavius murray scampers into the open field really nicely Picks up about 24 yards on the play. And that's going to bring up six out of eight. What did he do? Um, he tried to hit a crossing route that really wasn't open, but he kind of forced it. It was like a route bounce. Yep, got to run the ball. Has plenty of time. Now, you'll notice right here, though, this is a different defense for my man. So it'll be interesting to see what he brings to the table right here. Now, we got, I love this route combo right here. This is a really, really good one. Uh, got mesh post, basically. Um, and we're going to force feed the post. And he hits him over the end zone. Touchdown, RC. X drag trail for the win. Split close pats. One of the best offenses in the game, if I do say so myself. Everybody's running the Patriots book, but nobody runs it quite like your man RC. Nice read from my brother hitting that post route over the top of that cover one defense. A huge play in this game, shifting the momentum back to his side of the field. Now what he's got to do is he's got to go out and hold this man to three points or get a stop. Let's get it. 
my man Darren in the chat. A lot of wows, a lot of dots. Let's lock in, RC. What's up, Darren? Also, if you guys are watching this and you want to be a part of my CFMs, we play for cash money on Xbox and on PS4. If you want to be a part of uh, my CFMs, just shoot me a text message. Let me know you're interested. It's a $5 buy-in. And then, um, and then obviously you get to compete every single single season. Initial buying is ten bucks, and then every season after that is just five bucks to keep playing. Now the winner of this game does get the opportunity to compete for a Super Bowl championship, but not just a Super Bowl championship. A one hundred dollar prize goes to our Super Bowl champion. All right, three four odd. Let's see what's going down here. We've got second and six now, right there. That was close. That was very, very, very close to being an interception. It looks like my man Unrated is going to go to Trips tight end offset formation. Second and sixth situational football right here. And RC is going to adjust a little bit. Go to dollar three two six. And it looks like we're going to see a little bit of man coverage here. Now you've got to expect Unrated to maybe hit a hit an inside zone. Honestly, uh, it looks wide open. I don't know, max coverage, defense, 0-1 trap. I love that read. And I feel like that was more open than it actually ended up being. Third and four, ball on the 31, four minutes, and the clock is ticking here. But my man, RC, fighting back in this game. Here's the deal about CFM games. CFM games have a tendency to be a little bit longer than a head-to-head -head game. So there's a lot more time to fight and make adjustments and uh, be able to come back. We are going to start the next season of the CFM um, after New Year's, so probably on January 2nd. Good read from a man, Ars. Oh, unrated hits him. Oh, man, that was a really nice read right there. I think that was, was that just an out route? RC's got to keep his composure. Swallow a, swallow a seven. Now lock up, go down. Get seven and get a stop. That's what you got to be telling yourself. That's got to be your self-talk in these situations. It's so easy to do what I did in my game against Yashi. When I got down, I got super deflated, super struggling, and honestly, threw the ball away so much, threw the game away so much in that game. You've got to keep your composure in these big games right here. A little nasty speed out from my man, Unrated. All right, let's see what RC brings back to the table here. Now, I want to see RC run some of the simple route combos that beat man. Also, I think RC could run the streak glitch. Everybody knows that RC has trip side in. Trip side in, there is a glitch that basically just glitches out man coverage. So I will be interested to see what he does on this one. Let's see what he does in this drive. He's going to go to PA shot will. Actually, it looks like he's going PA counter go with the crosser. Bring it to Andre Hopkins in motion on that drag. Going to go with a drag and a dig. Max protect setup here from a man RC. He's got the crosser right over the middle. Marquise Goodwin with a big time first down. Again, a 14 on the play. Brings up a first and 10 ball on the 39 yard line. Uh, now, my man is still sticking with Dominant 4 6. RC is going to go to a little, little screen. I don't necessarily like that read. Um, you got to hand the ball off to your back. Your back's wide open. The lane's wide open for him to run through. Let's give the ball to Zeke and let Zeke eat. All right, we got second and 10. Ball on the 39-yard line. A little quick flat pass to Zeke. This time he holds onto the football and gets a first down. That's going to bring up third and three. This is an offensive shootout so far. Big plays all over the field. All right, ball on the 46-yard line. Three minutes, five seconds left here in the second quarter. Brings up a third and three. Now, you got to I, – I feel like he's going to run inside zone here. I really think he's going to actually give this ball to the back. I want to see him give the ball to the back. Should be wide open. Gives it to the back. Picks up the first down. First down, RC. Now, if you're RC, in my opinion, I would like to score seven going into half. I would not like to give him the ball back. Needs to run a motion slant. That's right. That's, that's what I would say, too. Want to see motion slant. Want to see him motion Hopkins over. Throw him on a slant route. Have a little whip route on the backside. Let's see what he goes to right here. He is going to go with a motion slant right here. 
Little zone coverage. He has Hopkins. He has Hopkins. A little secure catch right on the sideline. First down. Listen to the chat. Nice read from a man. R.C. A moniton slant, as Jay would say. What's up, Nate the Great? You think he should run some gun bunch? He does have gun bunch in his playbook. He's got some of the best plays in Madden 21 from gun bunch as well. That's what makes the Patriots playbook so powerful. Gun bunch, gun trips, gun U trips, gun spread, uh, single back, dice slot, on one trap. Really good run to be able to run down into. All right, here we go. We got first and 10 ball on the 40 yard line. And we're going to go with a little counter run. And the counter run opens up, and he's in the open field. Zeke Elliott, 40 yard scampers into the end zone. 14 to 21. My man RC just put us on notice. He is going to run the ball from Trips tight end. Nice, 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 nice play from my man RC. What is up, Nate the Great? How you doing, man? Good to see you in the chat tonight. If you guys are watching this tomorrow on YouTube and you have not come to one of my live streams before, we live stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time right here on my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Madden21TipsAndTricks. All right, so we got first and 10. Now, this is what we got to we, Here's what we got to do. My man RC's made some plays. But he really hasn't played much defense up to this point. I need to see more defense from my man. Marcus Dunson, what is happening, my brother? How you doing? Dollar 326. Now, it looks like Unrated's running the Patriots playbook as well. So, we got two pass playbooks. Here. I wonder if he got the New England ebook. Running a little slip screen. Now, my man Unrated loves to mix in the slip screen. Loves to mix in the slip screen. What's up, Adrian? How you doing, man? Appreciate it. So we've got first and 10, ball on the 37-yard line. Tick clock is ticking here. If you're unrated, you're good with three points. I mean, I feel like unrated, if I'm in his shoes, I'm mentally, I'm just trying to get three because I know that I'm up by seven, I get three, and then when I come out, I have an opportunity to go get seven again because I get ball at halftime. So it's a really interesting thing. He looks like he's taking a lot of time here to pick his play. Uh, on this first down. I'm actually really interested in this. Uh, and he's, ah, he, I think he's going to have to take a timeout. Yep, going to have to take a timeout here. Maybe that was strategy. I'm not sure. Unrated goes to a lot of different places. Now he's going to gun bunch. You're going to see some gun bunch from Unrated here. Dollar 326 from a man RC. Looks like we're going to go with cover one max coverage. Got to watch out for the post route right on the left side. Or if there's a corner route right on the right side of that corner route, right, watch the corner route right here. That could be something that he goes to. Let's see what happens here. Big Ben Roethlisberger giving the signals out. Now, Roethlisberger does not have gunslinger, so that's another thing that you got to watch out for on this play. Um, see a little back coverage here. We've got a crossing route to the tight end, and he's going up top, and, oh, RC with a big pick. That's a huge interception right there. If RC could go down and score, Darius Williams with a huge interception. RC's got first and 10 ball and 12 yard line, one minute, four second, and he's got three time outs to be able to get this done we can go over the jaywall glitch um in just a second if you guys do need help with that you can always text me but i will show you guys on stream here in just a second i gotta show you two things after this gameplay pa counter go for my man rc with a first down ravens now if you're in rc shoes i actually think it's okay to go down and just simply get three you don't have to go get seven you're living in a good world right here so this is this is huge, 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 huge right here. This is a huge drive for my man, RC. He needs to come up clutch. Gonna go back to a counter. I don't know that I like this play call, but he did bust us for a touchdown. He's gonna go PA counter go. That crossing route's been wide open for him most of this game. Want to see that drag? Let's see if he's gonna put. He's got Hopkins on a dig. He's got Jackson on a drag. I'm not a big fan of this combo, but it's actually interesting. The drag route's wide open. He's got the back out of the backfield. Zeke Elliott in the open field. For another first down, Ravens ball on the 47. I'll tell you what, RC's looking very comfortable in trips tied in. You can tell he put the work in on this. I believe that he should have as well. Whenever you start seeing man coverage from trips tied in, try that little J-Wall glitch once. If it, if it works, then they'll stop running man coverage 100%. But maybe that's just not how RC rolls. All right, so we got second and four. Ball on the... 47 yard line 
And it looks like we're going to go to PA Counter Go again. I'm not sure what he's doing right here. He's got like little baby in routes. These are interesting. Little mesh. Basically a mesh concept. Hits the in route over the middle of the field. And he's going to take that and get himself another Ravens first down. He's looking really solid right now. Looking really solid right now. So we got first and 10. Ball on the 27-yard line. It'll be interesting to see what he's going to go. PA counter go. PA counter go has been his money play. Kind of a just adapting out of this play here. Motion slant. Got the dig route. Love the dig route. I'm starting to see why he uses that dig route. He's got the crosser. Wide open. Big time laser. Marquise Goodwin. Wide open over the middle. Huge read. Now he's got 22 seconds left, two timeouts. So you got plenty of time here, nothing to be crazy, and really nothing to worry about, honestly. He has a ton of opportunity right here to be able to go in, tied ball game, unrated and dominated most of the first quarter, to be quite honest. Going to RPO bubble screen, and the bubble screen is going to do some work for him. He gets it out in the open space. Marquise Goodwin up the field. He's 16 of 19 for 219 yards, one pick. Really, really solid football right now from my man un or from my man RC. Now unrated, it's kind of on his heels defensively. I don't feel like unrated feels good with anything that he's doing right now on defense. I mean, my man RC has been able to walk him down the field here. He's going to go three through five wide. Now it'll be interesting to see what RC does down in the red zone here with this scheme. A lot of options with New England. He's going to take his back route, try to get out, and that's a really smart decision by RC. Picks up the first down and. He saved his timeouts by getting out of bounds. Really, really sharp right here. Execution, good clock management at the end of this half. That's going to give him three more plays. He's really going to be able to get three plays, and then one way or another, he's going to be able to uh, either take a field goal or score. All right, we got RPO bubble out of the trips. A little quick screen. He's going to give to Zeke. Good. I, I feel like he might have been able to get in there. Just missed the cut. And let's see, he's going to be on the ball on the five yard line. Trips tight end is glitchy. That's why we wrote an entire ebook on the trips tight end uh, offense. Really, the whole New England Patriots offensive playbook. There's 300 pages in it, 36 formations, over 10 hours of video content. If you want to pick up this New England Patriots offensive ebook that my man RC is running, type in the chat, exclamation point NE. If you're watching this on YouTube later, type in, uh, or it's in the description. All you got to do is go down to the description, it's right there for you. Little bubble screen, scampering out, and he gets the end zone. One of the best screens in the game, in my opinion. My man, unrated, is on his heels. That is a huge, I cannot stress to you how big of a drive you just saw from my man, RC. That's that's probably, had Yashi got a touchdown yesterday in his game, uh, or had he got a two-point conversion in his game yesterday, he would have probably had the best drive of the year. That right there so far, best drive of the year, able to cap it off with a touchdown, tie the ball game, going to have with really all the momentum. And I'm pretty sure that my man RC has just scored 14 unanswered on my brother. All right, now here's the deal. This is a word of advice to you guys when you run man up three deep. When you run man up three deep, you want to run cover two, you want to run deep half on the short side of the man up three deep, and you want to run a cover three, so a deep third on the wide side of, the, of that coverage. If you don't do that, you can get bombed. There are some bombs. We actually show one in our New England ebook how to bomb up man up three deep at the end of the game. So you'll see here there's a crossing route, and we're going to tackle. Okay, good job. Nate, I think what you're looking for is exclamation point game in the chat. If you guys want to get a Madden game in with me, type in the chat, exclamation point, game. So first half recap, honestly, um, I feel like RC shows has shown that he has a really, really good offense. My concern is that I don't know if RC can stop my man unrated. I mean, he got that pick, but that was kind of a forced throw, a bad read, really. Um, this is a big drive right here. RC is, ha, has all the momentum right now. The question is, if you're unrated, do you go back to that screen? What do you do in this situation? He's going to go to spread Y slot weak out of the New England Patriots playbook. Love this formation. It's one of my favorite formations in the entire game. 
It's going to be interesting to see what he comes out and does. Now you see here, RC is going to go to a little cover three Mabel out of the nickel 335 normal formation. little bubble screen right here from my man Unrated. Nice little quick throw. Getting himself to the sideline. Bring up a second one ball on the 34-yard line. little motion over the tight end. Probably going to be inside zone. I feel like if he's motioning that over. Yep, inside zone right down the middle. Good run, good run. All right, so we've got first and 10 ball on the 35-yard line. We've got about five minutes left in the third quarter. Um, RC, honestly, you know what? I feel like he's got to be feeling good, but Unrated has gashed his defense over and over and over again in this game. So my biggest concern is that he's not going to be able to stop him, and Unrated still has a possession advantage because he's going to go down and score, and then we'll be interested to see what RC is able to do. But here he's going cover three. He does not deep half his corners. He did not deep half his corners. A little slip screen out there to Raheem Mostert. Colonel Mustard in the open field. Another huge screen. Another absolutely huge screen in this game. My man, unrated. That man is the master of the screens. RC has got to adjust on defense. I don't feel like his defense is playing that great. Honestly, feel like he might want to just blitz him. Let's see if he sends some pressure here. He's played a lot of coverage this game. A lot of coverage. I really like this cover four invert right here. Yeah, two yellows over the middle. A little strong power for unrated, and that's not the call. That is not the call, my man. Not against 3-4 odd. Uh, that ain't going to do nothing for you. All right, we got second and 10 ball on the 33 yard line. Let's see here. Well, inside zone, nice cut. Nice cut from a man unrated. So dollar three, two, six for my man RC. Looks like he's going out in gun slot offset. Dollar three two six crashing the line out. Little quick screen there on the left side. You gotta watch out for that quick screen. It's a pick. It's a pick six. I think that's a pick six. I think that's it. That's literally a pick six. The flag's gonna be on the offensive line. My man RC just took control of this game. Unrated, running some stupid bubblegum stuff, honestly. Oh my gosh. 28-21 RC unrated i don't know what you were thinking on that one. Oh man not a great play call right there because rc has shown he's going to play coverage the entire game rc has pass committed every single time if you pass commit against that bubble screen completely locks it up In my opinion not a great not a great play call are the cardinals playbook effective i want to use a playbook that has rpo and utilize kyler's speed in a balance between the run and pass in my opinion the arizona cardinals playbook is the one of the best playbooks in madden 21 i would 100 percent say it's effective I actually have an entire book on the Cardinals playbook, exclamation point ebook in the chat. We'll get you my full Arizona Cardinals offensive ebook. It's got over 100 pages of material in it. Covers the gun spread, the gun cluster, the gun trips, uh, a lot of RPO stuff, a lot of really, really, really good spread passing concepts if you're interested. Um, so check out that, or you can shoot me a text if you want. I can shoot you some resources on that as well. Meanwhile, my man Unrated continuing with the screen game, and in my opinion... You've got to adjust to this. He's thrown he's thrown five screens. But shoot me a text message if you have any questions about the Arizona ebook. Exclamation point text in the chat. That way you can have my cell phone number. It's 812-216-3644. How do you sign up for the Xbox CFM? Just shoot me a text message and let me know you want to be in the Xbox One online CFM. All right, we got first and 10 here. Ball on the 35-yard line. Going bunch. A little wheel route. That ain't, that's not the read. That's not the read. That's not the read. But some people, if you guys, if you guys have been following, uh, if you guys have been following me for any length of time and you've seen me run the Arizona Cardinals playbook, let me know in the chat what you think of the Arizona Cardinals playbook. How you guys feel about the spread passing concepts? Uh, let, let's let uh, 
my man Simage, uh, let him know uh, what Arizona the air raid has done and what it's done uh, this season in competitive. All right, we got Ball on the 35-yard line, 21-28. RC's in a good spot right now. He's got all of the momentum right here. Uh, Unrated going to go to a little inside zone. It's kind of interesting. Um, kind of interesting how similar the 3-4 odd and the dollar three two six are in this game. So we got third and four, ball on the 29-yard line. Now the clock is starting to tick, and if you're on, if you're RC, you've got a one touchdown lead. If you can make him have to take about three more minutes to score, two minutes to score, as you see here, a little misaligned glitch, little man, oh, little SWAT hawk, dang, little SWAT hawk. Now this is critical here, forcing him to take a field goal. So then, what this means. Unrated, it's got to take a field goal. So he's going to go, it's going to be to 24 to 28. So now what's going to happen is, oh, he missed it. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, he missed the kick. He just missed that kick. Oh, my goodness. He just missed the kick. He's got to be, he's got to be so upset. Dang, he just missed the kick. Well, if you're RC, <laughs> go down and get three and you win the game. All right, let's see here. RC's going with a little stretch bubble. I like the play call. Now, you can tell that he wants to run out of the single back doubles. Now, if it was me, I would be running a lot of one-one traps, a lot of power O. Uh, I think the pat. I think, if I remember correctly, the Patriots have a O-1 trap from their single back trips. Also, ace close is another good formation to kind of run down the clock with a little bit. Um, I don't know if you're right in a position where you need to start clocking. But I think you got to at least be cognitive where it should see inside zone right here. 100% inside zone. He breaks it right at the middle. That's the perfect play call right there from my man RC. Puts himself in field goal range, and this might be over. If he chews clock right here, you if you're RC, if you just want to get the W, right, you don't want to be like Cody and just kind of force stuff. In my opinion, you run the ball three times, you take a field goal, and you force him to drive. That's what I would do. It's really hard to bomb the defense over the top this year. Um, if you know the right adjustments, RC obviously knows the right adjustments to that. So I kind of would play probably if I was in this game. I mean, you got to take this to the fourth quarter. But it looks like he's going to have about six minutes. If I'm RC, you got to take this to the quarter. Oh, he's going to snap it. Oh, that's a bad decision. Oh, but he's going to get it. He's going to get a touchdown. I stand corrected, and that is why you don't run dime one four six, right there, boys. It's the best pass defense in the game. The only problem is, what if they run the ball? Huge, 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 huge play. My man Seth chimes in. He says he can't believe he lost. So dumb how he lost. Did exactly what he was not supposed to do. He forced passes, and he didn't take his checkdowns. Be quite honest with you, Seth. That's how I lost too, my friend. All right. we got So we got two touchdown advantage right here. RC's got to be feeling good. Now, if I'm RC... This where you this where you straight up I literally this is no lie if I was in this situation and I wanted to win this game I'm coming out and man up three deep every play I know it sounds crazy I know it sounds rude I know it sounds not cool you're playing for a chance to go play for a hundred dollars cash you run man up three deep you run man up three deep in my opinion 35 21. Now he's a run dollar, which is close, but now this is interesting. Unrated has hit a lot of screens, so you got to watch out for the screens. The other thing is, it'd be interesting to see if he runs the ball. He's facing dollar. Um, this looks like a little bit of an auto motion. No, it wasn't auto motion. A little oh, a little play action, a little little slant route to Demir Bird in the open field, almost juked him out. My man. Uh, Claudius says next season he's going to dominate, not losing a single game. All right, let's see. He's going to go to the same setup. A little quick pitch this time in the open field. Gets a good gain. He's going to be able to get out of bounds. He might be in the end zone. He makes one more juke. Breaks a tackle inside the five-yard line. Now, this is terrible defense. I will not lie. 
I will not lie. Yashi wants to get a head to head game in? Yeah, we could do that, bro. 0 1 trap. I feel like RC's not playing the greatest defense in this situation. He's coming out in single back eights, and you're coming out in dollar. Come out in 3 4 odd, and cover 4 drop. Even come out in. Like, even if you came out in 3 3 5, it probably wouldn't get ran on that much. All right, right here. 3 4 odd. This should be cover 4. Cover 4 drop with the hard flats on the outside. And. Hits the bubble screen. Touchdown, Browns. We got a ball game. We got a ball game. As my man Air Ray would say, prevent defense, prevents wins. That's actually a good quote. My man Newt, what do I need to do to get into the next CFM? You need to shoot me a text. If you've already shot me a text, I got to go through my phone still. Got a lot of text messages I got to respond to. I've been a little bit under the weather the last couple days. All right. 35-28. But to be honest, unrated has not been stopped since the first drive. I, or, uh, since I throw out a sack pick, uh, or not unrated, RC. New England Patriots ebook has not been stopped in this game. He's been stopped by a throw out a sack pick and a fumble. That's how good that offense is. All right, let's see here. RPO alert bubble. And he's going to stay in dollar three two six. Now there, uh, his inside, inside stuff does a good job. Second and nine, ball on the 24. 37 seconds left in the game, or 37 seconds left on the play clock. So we got about four minutes left. Realistically, he can stop it twice, and he's got two minutes. So if RC, RC needs at least two first downs. He needs two first downs to put this game on ice. And go to the Super Bowl. Now he's got third and three. What's my favorite I formation for runs? Uh, the I form uh, slot in the Oakland Raider or Las Vegas Raiders playbook. Uh, and he's given him this flat route all game long. Stay in balance. That's a great play. My man RC is going to ice the game with a flat route. Looks like. Let's see what he does here. He's going to put Latavius Murray in. This has been a really, really good showing by RC's offense, in my opinion. Very, very good showing. He's consistently hit him. He's hit him over the top. He's hit him consistently for quick gains. Going to go to a little inside zone. All right, so we're going to bring this down as two-minute warning. So realistically, if RC gets a first down here, pretty sure the game is cooked. Especially with 40 seconds. I think he has a 40-second play clock, so he should be good. If he's able to get this first down right here, he's probably got it. Oh, yeah, this is second seven. Yeah, he definitely has it. So the question is, what's Unrated going to do? Now, it looks like Unrated's getting really, really aggressive against the run, as you can notice right there. So RC's... Throwing his flat route. I would like to see RC throw him on a swing route. I'm actually becoming a big fan of swing routes because they don't get picked by hard flat defenders. Even if their hard flats are on like zero yards. All right, third and five. RPO alert bubble. He's going to throw the bubble. Oh, he doesn't throw it. They had the bubble wide open. So unrated is going to have time. You've got to punt this ball. Man, I feel like you have to punt this ball right here. Mm, that's an interesting call from RC. He's going to go for it. Man, I really, I don't know about this decision. Let's see, if he, let's see what happens here. He's going to try to dot him up, fourth and seven for the game. He's trusting his offense. Run the slant, he's probably got the dig. Yep, I love this concept, the little crossing, a lot of stuff coming across your face. He's got the crosser. But the only problem is under pressure inaccurate, and that's why I don't like that play call. <laughs> we got ourselves a little bit of ball game here. Unrated exactly what he wanted. All right, we got 28 to 35, ball on the 43-yard line, left side of the field. 
Run an I-form, uh, I-form slot close. Haven't seen a lot of this this year. Might be a jet sweep. Let's see what he does here. Cover four invert. Runs a stretch to the left side. Interesting. Yeah, that was a huge stop. That was a huge stop. My man RC had the crossing route wide open. Only problem was he took too long to get in the ball. All right, let's see here. We've got second and nine. Ball's on 42. Little slant, little cross, little... And, oh, he... Oh, he almost got him. Oh, that was a... That was almost a lob touch. Oh, man, that was close. If you're... If you are RC, I feel like cover three invert with Mabel forces him to go to the middle of the field. He doesn't have... He only has two timeouts. Like, I don't know. I said I form slot. Yeah. For runs. Also, I, I mean, I form tight's really good, too. All right, so he's going to cover three. The only problem is he's not mabling. He's not putting that deep half out there. He needs to put that deep half on the left side. If he doesn't put the deep half on the left side, it could be trouble. Could be trouble. And he's going to throw it. I think, oh, he had him. He ends up forcing the weirdest throw I've ever seen to the outside flat. And that's going to bring a fourth down and nine. Seth, man, what are you talking about? All right, so this is your ball game, ladies and gentlemen. Fourth and nine right here. Ball in the 42. All right, he's going to pistol bunch tight end. He's motion his receiver out. Now, we're still going with deep drops here, so... I hope he doesn't. He's got the crosser. Oh, a user swat. And that's GG's in the chat. That crossing route was close to being wide open, but not going to be there. Man. Great game. Great game by my man RC. If you guys are just tuning into the channel, we're going to jump into how to stop the user rush here in just a second. But real quick, big round of applause in the chat for RC and Unrated. Great game in the CFM. Also, if you're watching this on the archive show, uh, be sure to go ahead and click that subscribe button. If you have any questions about our online uh, PS4 or Xbox One CFMs, shoot me a text message. $100 cash prize is going to go to the Super Bowl champion of both of these leagues. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you guys in our next video. All right, guys. Let's jump over here real quick. Okay. So GG's to those guys. Now here's the deal. You've all seen this, right? We've all seen this. We all hate facing this, right? In fact, I feel like I kind of have an ebook out that shows you how to do this. Exclamation point ebook in the chat. But this is the user rush, right? Comes right through the A gap and makes under center just not fun, right? Makes under center just not fun. Good game, unrated. Good, good game, buddy. So how do you stop it? Here's how you stop it. I'm going to set the user rush up first. So you'll see here, I'm going to shift my line to the left, crash my line right there just like so. The way you stop this is you slide protect. So L1, slide protect to the side the defensive line's on. So if the defensive line's on the right, you slide it to the right. If the defensive line is shifted to the left, then you slide it to the left. So I'm going to slide it to the left, and I'm just going to re make sure you re-block your running back. You have to re-block your fullback. And what you'll notice is if I try to come in, it's picked up, and I have a chance to make a read. Now, obviously, the pressure came in on the left side, and that's fine. I'm not really too worried about that. The one thing I would recommend that you do um, – if you're dealing with that, would be to do something like this. So they set up the user rush. Right now, you know this is coming from the left side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to block my fullback. And then I need to make sure to ID that outside linebacker. I do that. And 
And now, when I try to come in, everything should be picked up and I have a good chance to hit one of my routes. Okay? That's how you stop the user rush. Do you guys still... I got another question about uh, man coverage. You want to see... I'll show you the man coverage thing really quickly too. And then Yashi, you and I can jump into a game. Here's how to be. Here's how to glitch man for a one play touchdown. Man. I've shown this on my YouTube channel too. So if you have any problems with it or want the full video, uh, just shoot me a text. But I've been getting a lot of texts about this because people haven't been watching or listening to what I said in the videos. All right. We'll just do a custom game. You have to do this in play now. You can't, it has to be in a game. If you're not in a game, it won't work. Okay, so we'll just use the Redskins. And I'll show it to you from uh, Trips Tight End. the Patriots. RC, my man. All right, here's how to beat man. Let me see if I can, uh, let's see here. Oh, perfect. The Redskins get the ball first. Perfect. So all you need to do is you need to have some formation, whether it be trips tied in, could be bunch. I wouldn't recommend bunch. I'd recommend trips tied in or like far tight slot. I form twins, something like that, where you can motion the receiver across. Okay. So all I'm going to do is... Um, I'm going to set my settings up real quick and then I'm going to call timeout. So coaching adjustments, most people play with these coaching adjustments right here. They're going to put this to man align, ball in air to play ball, option on conservative. Uh, and then they're probably going to put these at like 20 yards, maybe these at five and maybe these at five. Okay. It's a very common adjustment for people to use. Now what I'm going to do on trips I didn't, you can come out at any play. It doesn't matter what the play is. My favorite play to do it from is drive post. Okay. Now defensively, um, most people are going to come out in three, you know, two, four, five, double A gap, any of these sets really. But I'll just show you how to do it against dime one four six. Okay. So I'm going to do dime one four six, and we're going to do cover one robber. And again, I'm going to use drive post. Okay. So they're going to press coverage naturally. All you're going to do is you're going to motion Quinn to the right. And then what I like to do is take Sanders, put him on a streak, put the running back on a little block and release route. Once he gets across the formation, I'm going to put him on a streak. As soon as I hot route him to a streak, I'm going to motion him to the left. And as soon as I let go of the left D-pad for the motion, I'm going to immediately hit X. And there you go. There's your free one play touchdown. Does that make sense? That's how to do it. It beats cover two man. It beats cover one. It beats everything. Regardless of ratings, settings, coaching adjustments. It's just flat out a man coverage glitch. That's how to do it. All right, Yashi, you ready to go? I'm going to grab a drink too. My throat's killing me. All right, I'm, pl I'm playing with my, my arch nemesis, Yashi. 
Yashi handed me a nice 51 to 7 butt whooping the other day in our CFM playoffs. All right, while we're booting up, I'm going to go grab a quick drink. I'll answer some questions. It does not only work out of trip side in. You'll see I can do it from far tight slot. You can do it from several different formations. Several different formations. I'll be right back. I'm going to grab a drink. Just shoot me a text with your questions if you have them. My number's now in the top left-hand corner of your screen. Yashi, I just shot you an invite. I'm back. I didn't go anywhere. Happened to have some juice. Happened to have some juice. All right, Yashi, I'm ready when you are. I'm going to be white uniforms, my brother. Let's go. What's up, Bradley? Classic Bradley. What's up, Rick? How do you beat people that run 245AA gap? A lot of different ways. The man coverage route that I just showed you will be really good for that. Young Simba. If you guys are just tuning in, make sure you hit the sub button. It's completely free to subscribe on YouTube. Also, if you want to support the channel and you haven't already joined the channel, some sick perks come with that. You can hit that join button down at the bottom right. Helps me out, helps you out, helps us all out, helps the world go around, really. All right, I got to lock in. My man Yashi kicked my butt last time. I think it might be my first game of the day, too, so this is not going <laughs> to We'll see what we can do. Put Big Leonard in there. Put Big Bad Leonard in there. Yashi is choosing not to baseline. Interesting. Going a little big nickel over G. Oh, 
Ooh, dang it. Zach Allen just went right through me. Brady. Big Ronald Jones. Big Leonard breaks a big run through the middle. That's what Big Leonard can do on that fullback slam. Fullback slam, Leonard Fournette to the house. What's the best runs in the West Coast playbook? Uh, they have a lot of really, really good runs. Can you please... Um, let me think about my answer. Fullback dive, 0-1 trap. Um, let's see what else. There's a lot of good ones, man. Let's see here. PA cross. I have that. Any wide trail. Alright, here we go. They have some really good runs. They have um, stretch alert bubble, which is good. I HB dive alert bubble, which is good. The fullback dive, 0-1 trap, halfback dive. They also have a really good 5-6 uh, trap out of the tray open. That's really, really good. Uh, it's a tough run to stop, in my opinion. So those are some really good ones. Appreciate that sub. Yeah, if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Daily tips and tricks. Come on. All right. JPP, Shaq Barrett. Perfect. Sean Murphy. Demel Dean, Carlton. All right, Yashi, I'm going to run that 3-4 bear. Oh, he's running some bunch on me. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. He's going up top first play. That was way too easy. Shoot. Yashi for six. Yashi loves this little bunch open. Loves it. Oh, bunch. Bunch, 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 bunch. You get old alignment issues it creates. I have not been able to figure out for the life of me how people have been doing that on me lately out of a press alignment. I'm thinking about stopping the press just because of that right there. 
I also feel like it makes it, I guess, more chess. Like if you're your soft squats, your little quick flat routes are delayed. That might be bad. We'll try that on the next drive. We're probably not going to press anymore in this game. Because I've been getting that a lot lately. He did the exact same thing to you, Newt. Little one play streak dot. Leonard. Leonard with the quick reads. Leonard with the quick reads. Hello. What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing in the chat? Good to see you guys tonight. If you guys are watching and you haven't subscribed yet, I'd highly encourage you to go ahead and click the subscribe button at the bottom right-hand corner. It's completely free to do that, too. Little fullback slam right into the teeth of Yashi's defense. Little fullback slam. That's what it does, man. That's what it does, my brother. Oh, here we go. What's the next passing play in the West Coast playbook? Um, the flats play. Do you know what the best passing play in the entire game is? Um, some would say double post. If Seth's in the chat, he'll tell you double post. In my personal opinion, the best passing play in the game for me is drive post. But if you don't think that drive post is the best passing play, then I think PA shot wheel is probably really close too. Is that you, new? Oh, that's you. Oh, I just got a text. All right, let's let's try a new style of D. Let's try a new style of D here. Let's try this. He's probably going to run a bubble screen. Yep. Oh, man. Okay. I don't like that. I gave it away. I gave away man coverage. That play is a problem. Would like to see those high-level Madden 21 videos and tips. Appreciate your text, bro. We'll shoot you the videos.
What's up, Kevin? I appreciate your text, bro. Do I play Mutt? Yeah, I play Mutt. Yeah, I did pretty good in Weekend League this last week. Alright, I don't know if this will work or not. I'm kind of nervous to run this. Might get streaked. There we go. There we go. There we go. Three, four, bang. Kevin, I'm reading your text right now, bro. I got my messages on my computer, too. Google Messages app, man. All right. Ooh, Chandler Jones says shalom. What are your adjustments for that blitz you're doing? Uh, it's in my defense V book, exclamation point E book in the chat. It's three four bear though. Little user rush from Yashi. Little user rush. We just showed you how to pick that up, boys. We just showed him how to pick that up. got a little too aggressive on that one who do you believe is the best team in regs the chiefs the bucks or the packers it depends on what scheme you're running if you're running the new england patriots ebook i would say the buccaneers uh are best uh the packs are really close though the packs are the best overall team in my opinion because you get a rod which i've said before i said back in july okay those of you that have been following me since july you know that i was talking about how rogers is going to be the best quarterback in madden 21 and sure enough He's the best quarterback in Madden 21. That's not even close, okay? So I believe the Packers are the best quarterback. Um, the Chiefs have Tyreek Hill. Tyreek Hill is a complete glitch. Like, he's a beast, man, 99 speed. So um, if you want to run, like, the Patriots ebook that I just released, you could run most of it with Tyreek Hill uh, at receiver and be able to have escape artists and a really, really, really good deep threat. So I believe he's good. You get a tight end apprentice. So I feel like the Chiefs are kind of in the middle. You know, if you need route chemistries, you want to use the Bucks. It's like what I'm running right now, West Coast. I think the 
West Coast is the best for the for the Bucks. Um, but you could run the West Coast with um, with somebody else too. Yashi going with some alignment stuff. Three, four, bear. Shaq Barrett just got mossed. What's up, Fly Drawn? You like the flats play on Madden Mobile? Yeah, it's a good, it's a good play. It's a good, it's been a really good play in Madden for years. That cross route. Let's see what Yashi hits us with here. She scored twice, and both of them been on super good streak routes. Is the Owen Trap out of the near close flex, near close flex, good? Uh, yeah, it's really good. It's really, really good, actually. Man, how do you get me? I just run man coverage. What's up, Stingray? I just got your text, my brother. How you doing? Man, this looks like a man is going after some Robin Hood. Appreciate that, Fly Drone. What's up, Naomi? How you doing, Naomi? I was wondering how you been. Honestly, don't know how. <laughs> Leonard. Man, good click on. Good click on right there. I don't know why Brady threw like a noodle. That's a big first down. That right there is so huge. Like, oh, you had COVID? Man, I know how that feels. You're running the Giants 3 4 defense. Um, the 3 4 bear would be really good with them. Dang it. 
Dang it. Yashi, Yashi's gotta be so pissed right now. Oh, I was almost there. I was almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Dang it. Dang it. I knew it when I threw it, too. Oh, it's freestyling a little bit on that one. Dang it. The one play I went a little bit off of script. Shoot. I had a freaking wide open tight end, too. All right. something out for that. That's a good that's a good screen though. You can't I probably got lucky to be honest. What's up, Brad? Uh 
That's a really good play, though. Is this Carolina or Seattle? I think it's, I think it's Carolina. Yeah, it did. It did. Yeah, yeah. No, I got. I probably got totally lucky on that. That's a great play. I gotta lab that. That's that's a good play. I've seen people run it, but like, Yashi runs it different than most. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yashi's red zone D is good. No, 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 no. Don't mess it up. I have him. I have him right here. Come on. Box. Let's her. Let's go. That's the... That's the dude. again that's kind of random that's kind of random that's crazy oh you're in the spread playbook just don't kill me with it just don't kill me with it please i finally beat yashi yeah when yashi was running was running a, a testing playbook Nice bike, yeah. Yeah, just shoot me a text if you want the far tight scheme. Far tight's kind of my favorite, but I can see why you run the other ones. If you start out in gun bunch, it's actually really, really tough because you have gun bunch as a base, and then you can go to all the other sets. <laughs> no man, Yashi's the best player I've played all year. Yashi's good, man. Yashi's tough. Alright, here we go. Oh shoot. Like I see Kyler Murray and I lick my chops trying to get a fumble. <laughs> Good play. What is up, Drippy Ron? How you doing, man? You can't stop bunch tight end crossers. Shoot me a text on that. Uh, are you using zone drops? All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's see. Oh, there we go. That's, that's a good. That's such a good play, though. I'm telling you, Yashi is such a good. I love playing with him. He's a great player. Crap! 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 Wasn't paying attention. 
Dang it. Good job. Classic Yashi. Good job, buddy. What's up, Dunson? How you doing? Oh, me and Yashi are locking in here. This far tight slot is such a fun offense. Uh, I just got your text. Yeah, when I release the far tight, I'll shoot it your guys' way. Also, tomorrow night is the Super Bowl. I forgot to say that earlier. Tomorrow night is the Super Bowl, so um, I'm going to cast the Super Bowl tomorrow. It'll be RC and Mason. Oh, Yashi, that hurt. Ugh. Dang, good play, buddy. Oh, she's tired of fullback dive. He's tired of fullback dive. He's like, I invented fullback dive. Why are you running my offense? Got that from my man Connor Morris. Got that from my man Connor Morris. When they're playing zone drops, we'll quick out. All right, you know Yashi knows what's coming. Oh, one trap, and he blows it up. Shamed me. They shamed me. Good deed. Oh. I don't know what just happened. That's crazy. My guy fumbled too. I was trying to lay down on the ground and he just fumbles. Huh. Crazy. Crazy. I got to shade up. Shoot. Forgot that. Good game, Yash. G G's in the chat. You going to go for two? Three. Four. Bear. High risk, high reward defense, ladies and gentlemen. A high risk, high reward D. All right. All right. I got All right. All right. You got to believe he's running. Running this right here. Let's see if I can get this. I just want him to run the run. I'm not even thinking about the defense right now. Bubble. Dang it. He threw a bubble screen. Dang it. It would have worked. I, the run defense would have worked, though. But I got to deal with the bubble screens. That's a good play. Man, good game, dude. That's always fun playing you. All right. How do I get the 3-4 bear ebook? Uh, You can text me. Shoot me a link. I'll shoot you a link to it. Uh, you can also type in the chat exclamation point ebook. That'll get you the three four bear. It's the whole forty six playbook, but it shows nickel three three five, nickel three three five wide, four six bear, three four bear, four six bear under, four six normal, and I think some other stuff. 
Yeah, that bunch open's good, dude. That bunch open's tough. Causes a lot of alignment problems. I wonder if Seth is in the chat. Man, I tell you what, I played pretty good on offense. I've been working on this offense so much lately, but this was just a bad read right here. This one, I got lurked. See here, I pick up his pressure, sending three. He's sending six at me with his user. So he's sending six, trying to get up the A gap. And right here, I can feel the pressure, but like you've got to hit your running back. I have my running back wide open. I don't even know what my running back's going on. I don't know what route he's even doing. I was also trying to hit the streak, and that deep half played it so well. I don't know if it has to do with where I was at on the field or what. I feel like that route should be way more open, but it's just not there. I didn't use the C route as much. I bragged about it all day on YouTube, too. All right, guys, I've got to go make the fourth, the far tight slot video. Shoot me a text if you want to receive it. If you want to catch the playoff game tomorrow, it'll be on the it'll be on the stream at 10 o'clock. Tomorrow's the Super Bowl. So winner of tomorrow's night's game gets a hundred dollars cash. Um so yeah, I gotta I gotta work on some stuff. Keep working, keep getting better, boys. Keep practicing, keep locking in. Use the Discord, exclamation point Discord. That's how you can chat with each other.